Hey, welcome to my channel. I'm Aussie Mark. Thank you very much for stopping by. In today's video, I wanted to show you some proof that being a part of the I Am A Creator community really does make a difference to the number of people who you get supporting your channel, or subscribers as you're probably used to calling them. Um, and I'm going to show you just what's happened on my channel in the last month. Stay tuned. So this is my Facebook page, um, just my normal Facebook page, not a nothing to do with drones or anything, just my personal Facebook page. And the reason why we're here is I want to show you a post that I made five days ago. So you can see, first of all, that um, the date today is the 16th of April, um, down here in the bottom of the screen. So let me scroll down to this post. And you can see that says April 11th. So that was five days ago. And five days ago, I'd made this post, just hit 1,700 supporters on YouTube. Oh yeah. <laughs> and that was a fantastic milestone and I absolutely loved it. So where are we today, five days on? Let me go over here to my YouTube page. And as you can see, I now have 1,762. I've got 62 subscribers in five days. So how on earth does that happen? It happens through the power of the I Am A Creative community. Being able to um, be a part of that community means being in touch with people who are active YouTubers and who want to support your channel and who want to watch your videos, want to make comments, want to share your videos sometimes and just generally be part of your community as you should be on theirs. And that's what it all means being part of I Am A Creative Community. You may have seen that on my last video. So I was at 1700 five days ago, now I'm at 1762. Let me show you some other stats. I'm gonna go into the creator, uh, my creator studio, because I want to just um, give you an indication, not only of stats, but also of watch time. So what we're looking at is this part here, these analytics, and you can see that I have, um, in the space of 28 days, and remember that's what the default is here, the last 28 days, I've added 145 subscribers to my channel. Now, a lot of those 145 are part, uh, in part due to um, being I am, I am a creator, being the hashtag I am a creator community. So not only have I got 145 subscribers in the last 28 days, but just as important is the watch time. And you can see I've had 20,464 minutes of watch time in the last 28 days. How much do you actually need in order to get um, your 4,000 hours watch time in 12 months? Well, you actually need um, enough so that it, 28 days is what it calculates at. And 28 days times 13 is the number of um, days in the year. So that's 350, uh, <laughs> you know what, that's how many days are in the year. Anyway, I digress. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna quickly pull up the calculator. Now remember we need four, oops, you can't see me, that's better. So we need 4,000 hours of watch time to, um, to be able to make YouTube happy and be able to allow um, ads to appear on our, um, on our videos. So 4,000 hours is how many minutes? Multiply that by 60. And we've got 2,000, uh, sorry, 240,000 minutes of watch time in a year. And remember I said there's 13 lots of 28 days in a year. So if I had to divide that by 13, to find out how many minutes per month I need, it's 18,461 points, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So that's how many minutes um, you need per month in order to achieve the 4,000 hours a year. And let's go back to this um, screen here. So this month I've got 20,000 minutes of view time already. And you can do that too through the power of the I Am A Creator community. So one of the best ways to be part of the community is to be part of the live streams that are um, being held by a number of the members of the I Am A Creator community. And one of the best people to be a uh, part of is James Cox. He is a fantastic advocate for our community, um, as are we all, 
but he runs live streams regularly. This is his channel here. And I'll put a link down in the description to allow you to um, uh, click on it and have a look when his next live streams are and come and be part of it. And when you're part of his live streams or part of anybody's live streams, just remember that if you're going to um, try and get the attention of somebody in the chat on the side of the um, channel, then you need to put the at symbol in front of the person's name and don't leave a space. So, you know, if it was James Cox, you, you might say hi and then hi space, the at symbol, James Cox. And even if you just start in, you only really have to put in the first three or four letters of a person's name and it will pop up if that person's there on the screen, of course. And, uh, and then you just use that and then write the rest of whatever you're going to write. So that when you actually then hit post for that particular chat, it comes up with a big red highlight around it on that person's screen so they can see that you've mentioned them. And if you're saying something like, hi, James, I think you're a fantastic um, supporter of the iCreative community. Um, you know, I'm, I'm now supporting you. I've hit the big red button. Then, uh, yeah, make sure that you put that at symbol at the beginning. So that's the guy and the description is, sorry, the link is down in the description. So make sure you go and um, have a look at that. Sorry about the noise in the background. My dog's scratching up the floor. Layla, stop that. Boy. Sorry about that. <laughs> Layla's uh, a bit of a challenge sometimes. So yeah, make sure that uh, make sure that you subscribe to James, as I said, be part of the community. And oh yeah, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, um, please hit that big red supporter button and give me a like as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Ozzy Mark and uh, you have a fantastic day. Bye for now.